Hi, thank you for purchasing Pelvic Pro. My name's Chris Aldred, I'm the inventor, and in this video I'm going to show you how to easily and quickly set up and use your Pelvic Pro device. You need to be sat on a hard surface, so ideally the floor. If you struggle getting on the floor, you can put a board on a bed. I wouldn't recommend that you use it straight onto a mattress because a mattress will be too soft, so the board makes it hard, but ideally use it on the, the hard floor. Open up your Pelvic Pro device and slide it in behind you. So sit on to the base as if you're sitting on a, a swing in a park. Okay, so the, the base is made up of a slope and a ridge and you want to sit on the slope which is nearest you. Okay, if you go too far, you're sat on a ridge and it's uncomfortable and you'll know you've gone too far because it is uncomfortable. Next, make sure that your finger's width between your hip and the ball, okay? Don't pull your hip away from the ball when you look at it. Tighten up your clothing and put your fingers down in between there. Make sure there's enough space. Next, and there's a great illustration in the booklet here on page six, and it illustrates what you should be feeling as you lie back. You initially start on the slope which is nearest you, so as you lie back, don't plant your feet, so allow your, your legs to be relaxed and let your whole body slide backwards and you go up and over the other side of the, the base onto the slope on the other side. Next, you need to feel for the hip, the bony point on your hip. Okay, it's usually found uh, on your trouser line, uh, sort of, it's around my belt here. Okay, and the Pelvic Pro spins around and you actually lay it on top of that bony point. If you're a bit bulky around the hip here, I want you to, to try and get it as close to that hip bone as you can, but it doesn't necessarily mean that you need to be on the hip bone. Anywhere close is absolutely fine. Close the device onto that, that bony point. Then the next bit is really easy. Come up to 90 degrees, lifting uh, the, the foot off. Your knee is at 90, your hip is at 90. At this point, you don't need to be pushing on the device. Then slowly lower your leg down until your heel goes a couple of centimeters off the floor. Don't let the heel hit the floor. Okay, so you come up to 90 degrees, slowly lower down, and that is when you push on the handle, okay? Come up to 90, slowly lower down and take about five seconds doing this, okay? And finally, I want you to do it with your breath. So as you come up, take a big breath in, and as you go down, five seconds, breathe out, pushing on the device. Don't let the heel go down on the floor, okay? On page 12 and 13 of your booklet, this has the prescription, uh, the prescription which is ideal for you. So look at, on those pages to see which prescription uh, you would fall under, okay? And you repeat as many times according to that prescription, okay? Come up to 90 degrees, slowly lower down, pushing on the device at this point, and go down so your heel is a couple of centimeters off the floor, okay? As it states in the booklet, always do both sides as well. And that is how to use your Pelvic Pro. So it really is that simple. So you've got everything you need to self-manage your back pain at home with Pelvic Pro.